Good day. My name is Max Hathaway. That's what I go by. And I am here to speak about the proposed development called the observatory. The rapid pace of high density residential developments in the recent years in Prescott Valley has caused many people to believe that no matter what they say, no matter what they do, the town council will approve any development. They feel powerless to protect their property values, to maintain the quiet and openness of their neighborhoods, and to shelter the scenic beauty and wildlife that drew them here to Prescott Valley in the first place. That's perfect, thank you. Um, <clears throat> emails that I have obtained from the town have given me hope that the opposition to the observatory will not fall on deaf ears in the town government. I'm going to give you two examples. On April 27th of 2023, the town manager, Mr. Davidson, in an email to Ms. Hunt, the vice mayor, had this to say about the observatory, and I'm quoting, staff has serious concerns with the density, layout, and infrastructure. It is not consistent with the general plan. That's an, I'll end the quote there. On April 13th, so two weeks earlier, Mr. Davidson, in an email to town staff, said this about the observatory, and I quote, water continues to be a concern for the development in that they want more units for the water we have available, end quote. Now I applaud uh, Mr. Davidson's con candor and I share with him concerns about the density, the layout, the infrastructure, the water supply, and the impact on the lives of the people who will be directly affected by the observatory. In fact, these are the very concerns that are animating the persons who, like myself, oppose the observatory. These emails and others that I have reviewed encourage me to think that there is openness in the town government to disapprove the observatory.